So you're just using your phone and all of a sudden you're back at your home screen. Well, maybe there's something wrong with your device, maybe it's faulty in some way, but probably not. It's probably a feature that you have turned on. Welcome to another episode of Apple's Questions. Yeah, all that. Sure, let's begin. So as you can see, I can do it on purpose, because it's a feature. You can see that coming back to home screen without even touching the screen. Have you heard of the back tap feature? It's a thing that allows you to double or triple tap the back side of your iPhone to perform certain actions. And I believe that this is what's currently happening to you. You probably have the back tap feature set to home and you're unknowingly tapping the back side of your phone and it just happens. Well, this feature works only on iPhone 8 or later, which is a vast majority of iPhones out there, so it most likely applies to you as well. So here is how to change and modify this feature. So on your iPhone you open up settings and yeah, in theory you can search for a back tap, but to know where stuff is, in the settings go to accessibility, tap touch, and completely at the bottom if you scroll down there, there is a feature called back tap. And using this, you can set whatever you want, I mean out of those options of course, what happens when you tap the back side of your phone. It's split into double and a triple tap, so you may turn it off as a feature completely for all back taps or set one of them as none, so that's an option of keeping just one of them active without the other. And what you can also set is a subscription to the Foxtag channel, cause here you're gonna find out like hundreds of videos, information and tutorials, definitely go ahead and subscribe. Anyways, I said that you're somehow limited to the options you have listed here. Well, completely at the bottom there is a section called shortcuts, and as you know you can create as many shortcuts as you want using the default shortcuts app. So go to the app store, download it and create whatever sequence or whatever thing you want, and you can add it here as a double tap or triple back tap which means that you can in fact set it to anything that you want. And that's why your iPhone keeps coming back to the home screen even if you wouldn't like it to. And if you have ever wondered why your iPhone doesn't charge past 80%, then check this video out, it'll definitely answer your question.